Hi, my name's Damara, and this is the archetype card that came out for Pisces today for the month of March. Networker. And this is so important in most people's lives these days, especially with the network, which plays a very large part in all of our lives. But it's how you do this and why you do this that, that is important. Um, and some people do stay in their own little network. They don't widen it. And I think one of the light attributes here is that it gives you the opportunity to uh, learn about other people and other um, cultures too, but also groups of people who think and work in, in a certain way and maybe not always your way. But it does give us that opportunity. And in every way, the internet has really opened up our networking, hasn't it? And all our networks to see that we can be a part of all different networks for a period of time or just to understand what that particular part of the network is about. So this is, you know, asking you, do you use networking enough? Let's have a look at the um, light attributes here. If I can focus this in. This is not focusing in. <laughs> Let's get the book. And it is, you know, networker. Part of it is being a messenger, being a courier, being a journalist even. But being a communicator is the main thing, isn't it? So for Pisces this month, this is a big question. Are you being a communicator enough? Are you communicating in the right way to give you the fullness of life? Pisces can be um, a bit distant in that way in uh, their character. If they are Sun Pisces or even um, the Ascendant. And I think, again, yeah, especially the moon as well in relationships. So the communication and the networking side of this is really, really important in their lives. I'm not a Pisces myself, but um, it's, a, it's an interesting question, I think, for Pisces this month, which could widen, you know, widen out their communication and their networking and not leaving them um, just with their own thoughts. I think that's a big part of it. That's what's coming through here for Pisces, not to be thinking on your own, but to be communicating either out with friends or out in the world more. And if you've ever thought of becoming that journalist, get on it because we really need proper journalists and not, um, you know, people who just write an article um, with the view of the editor or with the view of that particular newspaper who usually comes under some sort of left, right or extreme view. So having really good, ethical, authentic journalists, communicators, networkers in our new world is so important. And the question is for Pisces this month, this March coming up. So looking at the negative side of this, this is making sure that you're networking, not just for personal gain, that's, that's the first thing, but also that you're only networking information that you know is correct and not going along with the whims of other people's um, information that you've never checked out. So check yourself on that one too. Am I guilty of networking information sometimes on the internet or in person that I don't know whether it's true or not? So this is a, a real um, inward journey here, isn't it? Looking at what networking really is. Is it serving me well? 
Is it serving the community well? And is it also serving our new world that we are, you know, emerging into reality? So thank you for listening and please subscribe if you like this sort of information and it helps you. And thank you for allowing me into your space today.